Uh, hey there, it's Queen of Brilliant. I don't know what's going on with my hair. It's the Queen of Brilliantness, and I am coming back to you with Thief. I am still looking for that man's body. Um, let me get a hairbrush, but right now, where we left the list off, I was on a, um, uh, a line, assembly line, on a hook, well, I went through some steamy fog on the hook, and then I heard some men, so I dropped down, and then I went through this little path, and now I'm at a cutscene. This is okay. Yeah, my hair is actually blue most of the time. It looks black in this thing, but it's blue and black. Because my current web camera sucks. So it's kind of hard to tell that it's blue. It looks black and blonde, but it's blue and blonde. Anyway, like I said, we're in this cutscene. Um, you take a general surf. And for my men to do with their fucking toes. Put his body in the furnace. Check it for coin. No point in wasting a bolt. Well, getting this ring. Robbing the dead of their valuables and their dignity. A thief taker general achieves his own reputation. Time to steal that ring back. Steal the ring from the general. Okay, this is gonna be so fun. I got steal the ring from the general. Okay, go to where that little thing is. This is 13. Way 12, 11, 10. Wait, did I get everything? I'm gonna make sure I find everything. Fuck this shit. What up? Oh, I didn't. Hey. General wanted that ring all right.
Didn't see many bodies with rings until then. Hey, you don't suppose we uh, should be checking for, um, you know, concrete here? What the bells is a concrete? It's a ring for, you know, a gentleman's finger. Are you a No. shit, right? It told me to go that way. I went that way, and I fucking died. Fuck that bullshit. I'm gonna go my own way. That was obviously not the way out. Robbing the dead of their valuables and their dignity. General the general wanted that ring already. Right. What was that about? I'm not going that way. Fuck you. Don't even go into that. Don't take That's the only way. I'm here with my hand on a dead man's arse, and you're telling me about your brother tying his dog in a knot? No, no, please, Scott. Come on. Don't be having to go with my brother. Pass on. Yeah, I'm not the front. I should get prom and wife. You might need a bit of <laughs> That was three days. Hang on. Find.
Sure, I just want to observe. What the hell? I didn't. I was gonna have to observe. I'm gonna try that. Son of a bitch. Okay, well. That was the right choice or not.
Much to hope that he cleaned it, I suppose. That's a That's a strong box. Another of the Baron's improvements, perhaps. Look correct like any other. What? Oh, Jesus. I got like a puzzle going on there. Nobles never miss an opportunity to admire their own crest. Oh. 
Bravo. Get this door open. Break it down if you have to. Leave. I have the ring and a new best friend. But it's not over until I get out of here. I sneak out here to hunt the big rats when I was younger. It was abandoned back then. Since the Baron he sold industry across the river. Automation or metal and misery to save our talents. Oh, before we make it a crime is now far for that Baron. Sounds like the General's men finally found the switch. Thank <laughs> you. 
I don't know what to do. None of my buttons are working. Don't know what to do. Jump up. I'm pressing every button. Look. Damn it. Run! Run, stupid cunt. Run. Bitches. Hey, some fucking dumb bitches. My controller don't fucking listen to me. Okay, obviously, don't go that way. Yes, sir. Right away.
I look everywhere. You want to escape? Please be something else to learn. There's nothing else to learn. So. It's a long period of time. 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 Whoa. Whoa. I uh, just completed it, I'm assuming. Well, there you go. That was Dust to Dust. Um, The last of Dust to Dust, at least. Hmm. Oh, there's the last of us to dust. <sighs> that was really, really hard. I made a lot of mistakes. You need pure intelligence to be able to make it anywhere in this game. You need a really good intuition. Well, this is the Queen of Brilliantness, and this is the just completed Dust to Dust. I've only found two of the five collectibles. I got 30 and a 71 loot. Box picked five, pockets picked zero. Knockouts performed 16, suspicious, ri suspicious rise 10, times detected 14. Threats killed one. Catalyst, ghost, opportunist, or predator. My main is predator. Well, this is Dust to Dust, completing, starting the next.
collection displayed update. I am back in the clock tower now. This is the chest where I keep all my supplies. I should ready myself before I leave. I have not found any more loot. Oh, send you stone this time. Oh, diamond circle. Okay, I found more documents. Um, I pull out of. I got watch report. I don't watch guard my own. Summary weapon store 6C moved to the black alley stash. All armaments inspect and logged by guards. Mayan and cops. Restrictions regards new instructions. Regards the report from your cracks on handling of the gloom situation. I suppose that you draft a new report based on the following guidelines. I want to encourage a steady flow of gloomers through the work for the proceedings. Upwards of 100 a day should uh, should surface. I understand that sickness can develop with dramatic speed. Indeed, a man who might have appeared perfectly well at evening could be found on a death chart come in the morning. In this case, his house should also be thoroughly cleared before redemption. Your assistance in this matter will be appreciated. The Thief Taker General. One of one, the prologue. Madam Flower's relationship with Watch Guard continues. Husband still absent, sent anonymous letter. Mr. Retended apartment across the street. Must be consoled wall safe on lower floor. Left of the stairs, always something avail available passing through his hands, but can't see exactly where. He hides it. Knew he was up to no good. Tax month. Nothing for several days passed on. Never seen any relatives. Inheritance money. Buy yours diary. Chapter 2. Dust to dust. Four of nine. Break spot. Privilege notice, spring procedure, and off limits. Unauthorized and free beyond this point will be punished, no exceptions. If in doubt, consult with an officer of administration by district order of the Fifth General. Stripping procedure. One, 
Remove any remaining clothing and search the lorry. Check the limp lining off the boots and belt. Check the inside boots and the belt buckle, if any. Place any jewelry inside collection tray. Look for necklaces, earrings, watches, bracelets, rings, and such. 4. Don't forget in, inside the mouth. 5. Throw corpse and clothing in the furnace and re repeat. Remember, you will be searched at the end of the shift. These will be hung from the neck of the dead. Renovation notice. Beware of the immediate renovation of the Dale Street Iron Works. The factory must be ready to process the city's dead two weeks from today. Be careful of old materials from Barn North Culture's earlier project. Any area that cannot be reposed to process and dispose of cadavers should be considered inactable. The thief taker general will be personally overseeing this endeavor. I should not lead to remind you that delays will not be tolerated. Captain Swain. Congratulations. Army, you pulled corpse duty. It's not too bad if you've you've had the stomach for it. If you need to break the boys, and I have a place on top of manufacturing, only spot the grapher won't find you catching up on your beauty rest. Here's the rules: keep it quiet, no hogging, don't tap your pipe on the floor. If you're caught, no name. Newspapers, 3 of 19. Lockdown. 621 NRY842. The streets range with the cries of the watch, ever fighting against the ongoing plot of the gloom. The great greats closed, the curfew was called, and Mary was a difficult citizen seen in the street. Captain of the watch overseas dorm called the most successful quarantine measure to date. This lockdown is for the safety of our valid tenants, he said, overseeing the closure of Porter's Great this evening. And we have the Brian to thank for everything. He added before returning to a port what a truly modest hero of the city. The benefits of a strict crew. Stopping the dread gloom is everyone's responsibility. The lockdown of the city streets, like the livestock calls before it has been observed to have a marked effect, offered Dr. Troy of Stone, of Stone Market. It is indeed the most unwholesome interaction of Melania with the surrounds of the affected that causes the spread of his of this terrible plague. I recommend that all from the hail and healthy to the infirm should adhere to curfew. Meanwhile, ever since and may rest assured that the Burns finest physicians continue to work tirelessly finding the cure. This is truly a time of great change and progress. No old gods for the new city. This week, the Baron tutored the sites of the recently demolished chapels in Dayport. He expressed his hope to return short, shortly for integration of the pipe houses that would replace them. While some historians express instantly that the reconstruction work, all were quick to grieve that the city must move forward. Perhaps the buildings held historical significance, the barn generally debated, but they must make way for the significance of the future. Truly, the barn must be the third northwest to the outlaw worship of 
the old God, but the first to move beyond them. The great keep will ultimately provide power for the whole district. Well, chapter recaps. Chapter one. Lockdown. This isn't the city I know. I remember the accident at Northcrest Manor like it was yesterday. The ritual, taking the claw, burn, falling, dying. I'll never forget it. But now there's sickness in the air and death on the streets. This place was no rose garden to begin with, but it was never this bad. Everything's changed, and not for the better. Chapter 2 Dust to dust. I snatched the ring Basso wanted straight from the fingers of the thief. Vicar General himself, the Baron should should hand, but that don't give me answers. First Basso tells me I've been away from the city for an entire year, and then the Queen of Bagger says I was sleeping since the beggars found my body. So why don't I remember? Question mark. Maybe I have this gloom that's going around. I read all the newspapers. I read my chapter recaps. Chapter 4, 4 to 9. I read all those. I read the prologue and Stone Market 233. All that player progression. Chapters come player per play style. Ghost operation predator. I find things I want to keep. I put them here. Right now, the only thing collecting here is dust. How long have I? like our thief is wanted. Much like a session. That's what it seems like. Next. Uh, oh, I'm so tired. So, I completed the prologue, chapter one and chapter two. This is now starting the beginning of chapter three. So, Nothing changes hands in this city without Basil catching wind of it. He says it's a gift in my line of work. I'm inclined to agree.
hard to tell for a while. I'm assuming that there's going to be something in the video clip or something. I'm going to go this way. Good luck getting the administration to do the paperwork. Sworn I saw a man dressed in black crossing the roofs outside our apartment. Rooftops? What was he doing up there? I don't know. I pulled away from the window. If I couldn't see him, he couldn't see me. Someone start some trouble. I'll put you in their place. Not enough for my liking. I can still see your face. Albert's wife found him dead in the bathroom. He'd offed himself from the gloom. Blood everywhere. Shit. I saw her scrubbing the floors when I passed. She's been doing that since she put him out for the cards. The floors are shining by now, I'll tell you.
Nature? Your engaging conversation? I don't know. The guy you stole the ring for. You must have impressed him. Who is he? He's Orion. One of the guys standing up against the Baron and sticking up for normal people like you and me. Well, me, anyway. I'm gonna pause this for speaks a lot of sense. I got it. I need to make a phone call. Oh, shit. Okay. Fucking rarity in this place. He's down here helping the poor sods who have the gloom. It's nice to see someone putting their money where their mouth is. And, um, try not to be too, you know, you. We need this. Good that you came, Garrett. You're paying, aren't you? A little I have. Yes. Well, you brought my attention for now, at least. But, please, talk with me. The Baron favors progress over pain. Metal and stone over flesh and blood. Look what has happened. Get involved in politics. 
Ah, yes. You pride yourself on being a loner. Do you really think you have no stake in this? It works for me. For how long? Kurt! Uh, Eric, I'm slipping! This is your city, too? <clears throat> Whoa. <clears throat> what happened? You passed out. Are you okay? No. I'm fine. What do you need from me? I require a book. It's the only one of its kind still known to exist. I'm told it lies hidden somewhere in the House of Blossoms. <sighs> that brothel is busy day and night with the rich and famous. Discretion is the key. I don't normally hold with ceiling. Uh, in times like these, man of politics dealing by proxy. Sounds about right. As right as a thief who steals for a good cause. I'll get you your book. You will be helping to secure a better future for everyone. I'll remember that. I want to read this book. It's the same book that I read out of. Yeah. Uh, House of Blossoms. I never went there, but I know someone who did. This. Aaron. A visit Aaron's hideout is South Quarter. Uh, this is the start of chapter three, and I'm gonna quit playing for now. End of it. This is the Queen of Brightness. Remember, I'm always the Queen. Anyway, that is beef up until the end of chapter two, beginning of chapter three. Hope to see you later with more walkthroughs. See ya!